Jessica. Welcome to Vice Grip Garage. We're going to continue working on the crew cab. Today we're going to start on the interior. Normally we'll be working on the chassis and getting that done, but we're getting these seats custom covered, so it's important that we get them out and get them to our guy so he has enough time to get them done. As you can see, we have a ton of things in here, so we need to get all this out, see what we've got, and start making a parts list. Ultimately, what we want to do is get everything stripped out so we can start from the bare bones and build it up exactly how we want it. So let's get started. Normally I would get all this stuff out of here and I'd love to put it on a shelf or somewhere so it's organized. But Derek has so much stuff in here, I don't know where he got half of this stuff. But anyway, there's no room in here. So the only option is we're gonna throw it all back here because earlier today I ripped the bed liner out, I got it all vacuumed out. So at least we'll know where everything is at. So this is where we're gonna start putting everything. Looks like we have some spark plug wires, some boots, blinker lens, okay, not that. Like a fuel pump. Holly fuel pump. That's good. He's sitting in a box, you know. Sock for that. You even got the sock on her. It does. That's awesome. Okay. Uh, looks like a bushing kit for the sway bar. Um, do you have a box or something that I can put this in? Yep. Or an air cleaner? That works too. You gotta hurry, cause I mean it's getting, it's heavy on a guy's arm. Yeah. You gotta go faster. A box would have been better. Speed okay. it up. That's it. Got some more boots. Made it. You rock. Thank you for your order. One leg peg. Wait. Hmm. Zip ties. That might Work be, there? maybe that's where he works. I'm not sure. Well, he doesn't live in Canada then, if that's the case. Um, radiator shroud cover. Guy needs them. A light. Well, you gotta have those. One or two. Ooh. Got a bezel. Just one. Front end shiny thing. Yeah, that goes on the front under area. Stay. Oh, a neck brace. Yeah, yeah you need those. You gotta have those. Whoops. <laughs> Well, let's hang that up. Let's put it in the good part section. Let's put that right up here by this used oil. Yeah, stay. Oh, motor mounts. Yeah. That's the uh, LS to factory big block mounts. You need them. You gotta hook on them LS engines. There's our camper key that we've been missing. Oh yeah. <laughs> Jeez. Oh my God. Moses, we've needed these. We haven't been able to use our camper for two years, that's why. Okay. Pocket knife. That's a good one. Oh, this is a good one. Is line. that a Remington? My goodness. It still smells like leather. Keep it in here then for now. Put it up here with this. What's in the uh, glove box department? Is that a mirror? That's the rear view. Rear view mirror. Well, I'll be dipped. This guy needs that. Oh, can't tell the previous owner, I guess. Oh. oh. Can you read any of this? Is it good? Nothing. Yeah. Sliding rear window. That's factory. Oh, it does have that. Interim equipment change, air conditioning, mirror, stainless steel. Stainless mirrors. Rear axle. Well, we got a rear axle. That's good. That's like what's, the, what's the number on it? For what? I should say like 410 or 373. There's 900 numbers on here. What number do you want? I don't know. In here somewhere. Should be a number. I see 506. I see 752. I see. None of those make sense. That's what I mean. What have we got over here? Cigar lighter. You got a hair that's just. It's, Ow! I got it. <laughs> it's taken care of. That hurt. We Solid a... color paint, full foam seat. Is it good? Yeah. It's 
standard vinyl trim. Oh, we got vinyl on this. Custom moldings. Well, it, I mean, she was loaded up, is what you're saying, basically. Yeah. Get all that out of That's there. That's not really the interior. I don't really worry about that so much. It's like we got the Dakota digital gauges. Moses. What is that? Looks <laughs> like, I don't know. Pajama pants? Pajama yeah, pants. You need those. Yeah. Um, flex plate spacer, it looks like. Yeah. With or without the bolts. That's got the silicon on the bolts already. And, oh, another blinker lens. We're complete. That's two. Another light bezel. That's the other one of them. Sit. Oh, wait. Oh. Like melted Laffy Taffy <laughs> on the feet. And I saw something really cool down here. You make the difference. Green Bush Centennial Parade. Put that on your shirt. Oh, B. 2005. Oh, and it twist off hands. Oh, bad wizards. Oh, it is hands. It does say hands. Oh, oh there really wasn't as much stuff in here as I thought, but definitely enough. Careful with them, those are a touch spendy. Yep. Alright, so now we're gonna rip off the seat covers. I kind of want to see. Oh, you dropped the button. Be careful. I kind of want to see what's under this other seat cover. Oh, it's so old that I kind of just. Get your D12 in it. Pull. Yeah. Use everything but your legs. Use your back and your neck. Isn't that wrong? <laughs> Aren't you supposed to use your legs? No. Nope. And not the other That's stuff? a wives tale. This is looking pretty good actually. We might just... Well, you know, we... I'm kind of surprised. Why don't we just leave these alone? I just love the like design that we come up with. I mean, for... they smell like Hot Pockets, but I mean, you know. What are you doing over here? I'm just getting... Get it. Move it over. Yeah. This seat is brand new. It's I mean, really nice, actually. Oh, usually they're just gone here. Oh, it's pretty bad over here, actually. Is it? Oh, the old driver's side. Let me swing over there. Oh, the driver's side. Oh, yeah, she's down over here. This is really typical. She gets cold and she just shoots apart right here. You know, nothing a guy can do. Dang it. That's literally, that's it. On all the seats. That's not bad though. That's too bad. Dang. So we're thinking where this kind of dark brown is, we're gonna kind of put, I don't know, some sort of orange and kind of this color, maybe some silver and gold, some other, I don't know. There's gonna be colors down, and shooting this way, in between here, maybe a little narrower. That's, that's kind of the good. plan. Yeah, that's what Jessica wants to do. She's doing, I don't know, she's doing the interiors. I'm doing the engine. So this is kind of her thing. Why is that so long? What is that? Well, that's how you keep it together underneath there. Laying on it. Just it just doesn't want to come out. Just rip on it. Pull. Get your back into it! Stop! <laughs> You're so dumb. Wrapped around here. Just pull back. I did. Lean. Again. It won't. <laughs> Harder. Where'd that knife go? Get your leg up on the sill and just just pull on it. There. <laughs> See? <laughs> Told you. Done. All right. It worked. We're gonna get these bolts out of here. Alright, we've got two bolts left behind this seat here, but it doesn't fold up or move, so we have all these extensions on here so we can reach it since the 
impact won't fit back here. Had to make this jack handle a cheater bar because it wouldn't come off. Jessica's got the lap belt sprayed through the seat. So I think we're gonna feed her on out this way because we got more room because the piece of wood holding junk over there is in the way. So all right, this gotta lift and oh that was way easier than the This is actually really light. All right, you want to crawl in and then kind of keep scooching? Oh, yeah. Careful, these, this bracketry, she's sharper than Sarah Jessica Parker's nose, so. I found a bag of candy. Hold on. Hold on. TV blaster. She's full even. Got some candy. Yuck. What is this though? That's a brand new screwdriver set. Oh. Are these cool jumpers? It ain't jumping. Oh, he doesn't jump. I do like these screwdrivers. Alright, hopefully this rear snags out the same. Oh. Oh, we got some different bracketry on this one. Yeah, this one's a lot different. Just watch the paint. That's all I care about. Uh oh. Well, you know what? Put it in front here? Yeah, let's slide it forward and go to the front here. Stay off. That must Out? have been off. Please stay off. Hmm. Oh, brand new ratchets. Scotch oh. Super 33 Plus electrical oh. tape. Oh, be dip. Let's go in the front pocket. Plus, you always need some good old Windex. Windex. What'd they buy? DZ for the top or something? Window crank biscuit thingy. Running boards is what it was. Ooh, is that a pencil or a pen? Pen. Nice. That's front pocket. Anything oh, else? There's a nail. That's still good. Looks like there's a watch battery. Ooh, a couple of them. Fuse. So far, no big holes or anything. You wanna hand me the sucker upper? Yep. Yeah. And I'll get this cleaned up. Clean it up a touch and then I'll take these silk plates off. Are these even on there? Oh, they are. This is for the... Huh? All the bed rails? Yeah. Get these sill plates off and then we can peel back this rubber. That's and... actually in really good shape up there. Yeah, I should keep that for the other truck. Now what we're hoping for is there ain't any, you know, speed holes that we got to fix. Because that'll slow us down another 846,000 months. And this looks pretty good. I mean, if it's that clean, I'm thinking it's... Should be alright. Hopefully. Because even the you know these things where the rocks hit, those are pretty good. Time to get these sill plates off, but I like to shoot a little parts cleaner in these screws here 
because they fill up with junk and then a guy just strips them out and then you're hosed. So we've done both sides and Jessica's going to get that side out and I'm going to finish going around and hitting these. You know, you just, just a little. Like that. And then that brings those, you know, you get your grippies out of there. They show up. You done yet or what's going on? Yeah, I'm getting it. Back ones are more faster, but. More faster? Mm-hmm, it's a thing. Okay. This stuff looks good. Anyway, cut the silk plate off over here and yeah, that's not good. See, a guy can see his foot under the rig. I don't think that's supposed to be there, so a little nervous to peel that back. And then found this gasolator nozzle, so they must have had a tank in the rear. And they did the right thing and just made a humongous hole and then jammed this through. So then I too did the right thing and just took my metal remover 200 and just zzzzed, ground that out. But that means that none of this fuel equipment, oh that looks great. <laughs> yeah, this isn't going to run the Holly pump, none of this stuff. So now not only are we welding in floors and a seat hump, but we're running all new really expensive high pressure fuel line. Yes! Or this snag just mat out, but... Is it okay if it tears? No, go easy on her. Well, it's got some tears in it. I'm kind of nervous. get, go, just be gentle. They need this for that 79 short box, you know. Ah, see, it's already... Well, get in there and ease her out. There, oh, see? that was way easier. <laughs> I'll fold on her and give her a tug. Oh, look at this. Factory sound line. Oh, dang. Is it bad? Well, we got some ankle vents here and that one over there. She's looking pretty good too. So we'll have her rip this out and then we'll see what's going on. Oh, under there. What was that? That's pretty good. I think we're good back there. Might just be, you know, a couple license plates there and one right here with some spray foam ought to take care of that. Oh, this part number is still stuck in here. Oh, okay. She's stuck on. Yeah, a little bit. That's shiny stuff. You just you don't see that much anymore. You go. This isn't near as bad as the front. No, I think we're good. Well, that's good. So then we just have in over there and pretty much it for the floor. You might as well vacuum this out too, huh? Yeah. It's coming along good. Cleaning up. We hit her with the old gunk wipes and the guy and the gal is following it up with the spray away. That's good stuff too. And it'll take a couple passes, but we don't have the luxury of pressure washing it. That's just pulling off the weather stripping. On that side, this is all going to get replaced. That one glued in there pretty good. Yeah, that's what it Yeah. 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 Get out of there. Come on now. There we go. These are pretty affordable and will cut down on that wind noise, you know. There, we go. there she's stripped. We'll clean up this side a little bit more and a little bit more over there, I think. And then, I don't know, I guess we got to figure out what we're going to do next now. We'll probably start fixing the rust and then we'll dynamat this or do something for sound. You know, and heat and whatever. Now we're going to order some carpet. You want to do carpet? Yep. Carpet in here, the boss says. And then figure out the seats. 
I think that's going to do her for this episode. She did all the work today. It's kind of nice just, you know, standing in the back drinking the wobble pops and tinkering on the bench. And why don't you know what the interior got stripped? So if you're not subscribed, now's the time to do that because we're going to be basically doing little shorter videos like this of pretty much everything. We've got the interior finished, we've got the LS swap, we've got C notch, we've got the list is long. We're getting her ready for power tour, so it's all got to happen in the next two months, three months? I don't know. Yep. There's days on a calendar and it's coming fast. Anyway, thanks for watching. See you next time. Bye.